Okay, so let's walk through lesson seven. So we are going to cover the Caesar cipher, it seems. Okay, let's look to, at Wikipedia here and see what the Caesar cipher is. So in cryptography, a Caesar cipher, also known as Caesar's cipher, the shift cipher, Caesar's code or Caesar's shift, is one of the simplest and most widely known encryption techniques. It is a t it is a type of substitution cipher, which each letter in the plain text is replaced by a letter, some fixed number of positions down the alphabet. Okay, so that's it. Looks like so. If I have the letter A, for example, okay. Oh no, I you know I think I understand this. So that basically means that if I have the letter A and I give my function a value, some number say one, then I should move my, I would get back a string of B or something like that. That seems, that seems pretty reasonable that you give it, you, you use the cipher in order uh, with a, some type of text and you shift every letter in that text by the number that you are providing so that, and that way you get out the encryption or the encrypted text basically. Okay, I, I think that, that's, that that does make sense to me. So let's look at the Caesar cipher spec here. So first and foremost, we are grabbing the cipher, which is, okay, so it's, yeah, yeah, it's a function. It gets a string and some type of value. Okay, I think, I, I think I'm, I'm starting to get a feel for this. Right, so the first test is, Let's see, adds a positive number to the character code. Okay, so I expect to get back a string of BBB. So if I grab my cipher function and I add AAA and a number of one, then yeah, exactly, because B is the next number. So if I add one to all these these letters here, I'm going to get back these letters or the str a string of these letters. That makes sense. <laughs> Okay, and then you have, what's this? Adds a big positive number to the character code. Okay, so AAA and cipher with AAA and 27. Ah, okay, so it's gonna wrap as well. So if I add 27 to AAA, I go to the end of the alphabet and then I start over. So I should go get back AAA after adding 27 to all of these letters. And, Oh, okay, we need to be able to do it in both directions. Okay, so I expect AAA to be re retur returned if I give a string of BBB with a number of minus one. And as a big negative number to the character code, okay, so AAA should be to returned as B BBB, or oh, sorry, BBB should be AAA if I apply minus 28 to it. Okay, yeah, th this 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 makes sense. Okay, this is a little bit trickier than the other ones, but I think we can make it through this, right? Let's see. Let's see how we do. <laughs> 